everybody and welcome back to my channel so if you guys are new to my channel my name is Colleen and today I just have a little bit of a hair tutorial for you guys this is my first time filming anything like this like a YouTube video dedicated towards my hair or just like beauty related so it's kind of new and I would love to hear your feedback but I get a lot of questions asked on a regular basis on how I style my hair and how I get it to look the way that it does when I post on Instagram and things like that so I decided to show you guys how I got my hair to look like this and how I styled it what I used and things like that if you guys are new here make sure you guys are subscribed to my channel to be notified whenever I make a new video and also follow me on my Instagram if you guys want like daily updates on my life or whenever I'm gonna post a new video so if you guys would like to know how I did my hair like this then just keep watching so this is kind of what my hair looks like out of the shower so very flat no wave or anything it's kind of just straight first thing that you want to start off with for at least my hair is I like to start with clean hair that way I can wear the style a little bit longer this is the tool that I will be using today so this is by Conair and it is a one and a half inch barrel and we are going to be using the clamp today guys so I personally like to part my hair into three different sections to curl. It just makes it a little bit easier and you can kind of see what parts are curled and what's not. But you're going to take a section of the hair, you're going to hold it in one hand and your curler in the other. And you're just going to clip your hair like this and twist outwards like that. And you're going to curl back upwards. And then you're just gonna occasionally release the clamp to gather more hair into the wand or the curler, sorry. And then release it and then just hold it in your hand. What this is gonna do is just going to enhance the curl a little bit. And sorry if I keep looking in the viewfinder, it's literally my mirror today. So I usually like to take this big of a section to curl and you're going to take it and you're going to curl away from the face release and then pull up a little bit now the motion that you want to curl your hair in is always away from your face it's just going to frame the face a little bit better Obviously, you can always alternate the direction that you're going in, so you can go inwards and then outwards, but that's going to give more of like a wave compared to like a blowout that we're trying to achieve here. And then it's the same deal on this side. You're just going to curl away from your face again. Grab your curler. I just freehand my sections and then clip up the rest. Okay, so the first two sections are done. I'm just going to work on the last section. It's pretty much the same, but I'm going to meet you guys where we are going to be talking about the front pieces. So I look kind of crazy, so I just put all my hair to the back except for the front two pieces. But basically what you want to do is 
we're going to frame the face but we're going to curl it away from our face and it's just gonna look really really seamless later but one thing I do want to mention is that I do cut my own hair when it comes to this part um, I just like pieces that frame my face so I kind of just trimmed my hair a little bit so that I can achieve this look but obviously if you guys are too scared to trim your hair yourself definitely just go to a hairdresser once everything is open it's a little choppy I will say that but it still looks okay when I curl it and stuff so anyways what you're gonna do is you're just gonna take your curler and you're going to basically do the same motion but I kind of tilt my curler a little bit like that and then just curl like so release it and then that's kind of the look that you're gonna get and then the same thing over here so everything is curled you can obviously just leave it like this and it's a really nice little 2006 Kim Kardashian look but for the most part I like to curl my hair at night and then um, tie it up in a bun it sounds crazy but I do that and it comes out very loose and blowout like which is what I usually prefer for the sake of the video we are going to fake that fake the sleeping part and we're just gonna brush everything out so I like to use this brush it's just like a boar bristle brush and I'm just going to brush everything out So after you brush it out a little bit, this is essentially what you're going to be left with. And I just want to give my hair a little bit more volume because my hair is really, really flat. So I'm just going to take the crown right here and I'm just going to back comb it. So you're just going to back comb, brush it downwards. It just leaves your hair looking a little bit more full. I'll even do it like around my face too, so it kind of adds a fuller effect. After playing around with your hair a little bit and teasing it a little bit around the crown area, this is essentially what your hair is going to be left looking like and I just like how it just imitates a fake blowout look and you know I can never do like the, the curling with the brush and my hair dryer so this is kind of what I've opted to. I've even tried with like a straightener and it just it didn't turn out the way that I wanted it but I'm really happy with how it turned out today and I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Let me know what you guys thought in the comments down below. Let me know if you guys like my room better than like a white wall because I don't know I kind of like this a little bit better. It's a little bit more personal and you guys kind of get a little bit more personality out of me. I don't know. I don't know, but let me know what you guys think in the comments, and yeah, I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.